In this video, you will see how to obtain a simple random sample using the TI-84 calculator. If I want to give a quiz to five, out of my, five of my students and have a total of 25, I can use the calculator to do this. The first thing we want to do is list the frame and I will just number each of my students from 1 to 25. The second thing we want to do is to set the seed on the calculator. This is the initial point for the generator to start creating the random numbers. If everybody sets their seed at the same number, we'll all obtain the same numbers in our sample. So to do that, where we're going to go is under where we want to initially set the seed. So I select the number 12. Then we're going to press the store button, which is right above on. So this just assigns this value. Then we want the RAND function. So we're going to go to the math button, scroll over to get to PRB for probability, and there's our first option, RAND. We press enter to select it, and then we press enter again to complete that assignment. Now we're going to use the random integer. We're going to go back to math, we're going back to the PRB menu, And we want option number five for random int, so random integer. You can always press the number five or you can press scroll down and press enter. So our first number is where we want to start. I started numbering at one, so we're going to use one. We use commas in between. And the last number that I have is 25. And the third number that we enter will tell how many I would like in my sample. I would like five different people in my sample. So close our parentheses, we press enter. Now my sample says I want student number 24, student number 7, student number 8, student number 16, and student number 7. Here we want sampling without replacement. So I need one more student to select. I can either rerun this statement and see the different numbers that they give me or I can just select one more integer. So we can do the same process again by pressing the set again button and then enter and that just relists the same line. We can press enter. So now I can select person number one or I could just use this entire sample as well. If I just wanted to get one more number, we can go to math, go to PRB, random integer, we're starting with 1, we're ending with 25. If you don't enter a number at the end, then it just lists it as one number at a time. 